Hi I'm guys. I'm not back. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'll try not to cry this episode. Last episode was so sad, sad and painful <laughs> for her to watch. And and frustrating again. Like I've been frustrated for the last couple episodes. <laughs> yeah. Elle is gone. And by what the way, is gone. Yeah, Rem was gone. Rem was gone. I don't care about him. He killed Elle. It was a nice of the Shinigami of the two. Oh yeah, true. And he did do that because he wanted to protect Misa, so he was forced to do it. Mm. Which means that L light is up. Um, he should have just killed Light. If he killed Light, Misa would have to be put in danger. <laughs> right? <laughs> I guess. Which I was thinking Well, she, 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 she might have killed everyone else because she would be frustrated that Light would be dead though, so... The, only, the best way to protect Misa at this point would be kill Light and take the Death Note away from Misa. And have a nice happy life on your own. Yeah, that's it. Like, let's go. But uh, I, I, I guess Remu was just not seeing it that way. Anyway, our guy is dead. Now uh, I'm, I'm, I'm still, you know, I still have the tear tracks because we just watched the episode. So, all right. I'm still frustrated about this, so once this episode starts, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna say some mean things to Light, so I'm sorry in advance. Go ahead. Like, well, you should have expected this. Like, I'm, I love Al, he's my character, so if now that he's dead because of Light, and he got to play, like, oh, poor him, he's dead, yeah, yeah. I know, I'm not happy, so we're moving on with this episode, let's see what happens. Yeah, we didn't introduce herself, no? I'm Chris Scaler, <laughs> and I'm Professor Gushin Cosplay, and today we are watching, you guessed it, Death Note, episode 26. Fuck that shit. Let's go. We won't keep silence about that. Yeti. Oh, this it ends here? <laughs> yep. Okay, he had a, uh, a puzzle with L on it. The with just, with just L on with it. With just L on it. It's all white. Jeez. <laughs> but this is good then. It means that he's good at, um, at, at doing puzzles, which is what we need. We need people who are able to piece everything together. Because La L left a lot of clues behind. Like he left his, uh, like he, in the beginning, the recap was his letter. Like it was his, uh, his accomplishment. He left these pieces. Now all he needs to do, like all these two need to do, is piece them back together and find a missing piece, the one he didn't put on top of his tower and stuff, and the do chair. with drama, you know? Uh. If Light can do this, well these guys can do <laughs> this. this. Can do this. <laughs> if Light can dance, he can do their own the, the, the dance off. Too. I mean, and L left all the instructions. You All did. the pieces, they're there for them to just put together, and that's it. Oh, I'm so sad again. I'm not gonna cry this episode, though. We clearly saw that knowing that Elle is dead, Light doesn't care to be <laughs> reckless. reckless and it's like, I'm so frustrated that the others are not even seeing this. Like, Elle's... L dies, but no one is supposed to know because he had a secret funeral. But then suddenly a lot of people are dying. Like suddenly he knew that uh, he, there was no one to stop him. They thought that Kira could help. So somehow he found out his identity. He doesn't, didn't know that Kira was light. No, but obviously Kira but obviously knows. Obviously know that Kira knows that L is dead. So that's why he took out so many people. What I found it's horrible though it does you cannot it's an era of terror technically because yeah. knowing that if you go up against Kira you might end up be dead and the thing is like the other people like people that are living normally the only way for them to die because of Kira would be to either be very unlucky and fi find him as he's writing dramatically in his death note. Mom, what's the man doing up there? Ah! <laughs> so either that or it's because you did some kind of crime. So yeah. in a way, like I do see why people would say that Light's new world is a good world because people are too afraid to commit crimes. But I see how wrong this is. Why is it that... 
outlier people say, oh, I'm not despising Kira, it's bad what he's doing, but yeah, they're saying this. In their mind and up low, said that, oh my god, I'm cheering for him, yeah, it's good what he's doing, he's killing the bad guys. I can see that happening. This is not how true justice works, though. Especially in, in the way he does it now. Like, he kills people without caring what they did. Like, he killed the two people that uh, worked with L be, uh, because of uh, their connection to him and how he they killed knew. every person in the Yotsuba company because they were, knew about Kira's... Yeah. Weird, how it worked. Them. Or they knew but too much. They didn't even know, though, how it worked. They could have guessed it, though. Because, I mean, they knew enough. So, the thing is, now there is no one in his mind who could stop him. Which, weirdly enough, I find it interesting because he, it looks like he is actually sad that he doesn't have this nemesis anymore. Well, at the beginning of the series, he was bored because nothing was a challenge to him. What he found interesting was the excitement about creating this new world. But then he saw someone who could challenge his mind and make it interesting. Like it was, he saw this as a game, and now that the game is over, he's back at the beginning with you know creating this world. But now he he did feel that excitement. He did go through this, so not having that anymore. I think maybe light, not Kira, but light has developed some kind of friendship too. Even though he always said like, oh, I need to find a way to kill him, and I'm just pretending. At one point, you cannot pretend anymore. And weirdly enough, like, yes, he, he got all his memories from, you know, the time he was Kira back. But he also has the memories of himself as Light being friends with Elle. So I, I think that maybe deep down, he does feel some kind of companionship. Like, he does feel maybe sad that he had to do this. But it's being, well, I mean, it's going to be overcome by his need for to create this new world. We go back yeah. actually to uh, to light way before, like in the, in the beginning of the series, when he was saying, this is not an easy task, but I have to do it and I'm the only one who can do it. So it's like he's saying, I'm not enjoying it, but I'll do it because I have to. This is what, this is how he used to be when he started. This is not an easy task, but I have to do it. Like, you know, mm -hmm. now he's enjoying it a lot. Like, he, he, but he was enjoying it because we know that he, he hates losing. And he felt it was a game against L. So he felt like he needed to do anything he could in order to win. Yeah. So he got this thrill. Now it's back to... I have to do it because I because ah, that's my is, duty as the yeah. new god of that world. But he's not. I mean, this persona that he has of uh, him, you know, being crazy in the head and you know just being blinded by his idea that he is a god and he has the power to do anything and, and I mean, no one can stop him. That's still there, and I think it's gonna come out again. Like this crazy persona, it's gonna come out again as soon as he finds out that there are people working against him still, and they're not. I mean, they're not. Like L, like it, it's it need we need two of them in order to at least try to piece together what L did alone. So I'm I'm still a, a L lover. I'm sorry. Like um, <laughs> don't take it the wrong I'll way. This be is an L lover fan base. This is me being a fan girl. <laughs> you know what? I want to say something in the previous episode when L died because yeah. we kind of knew that L slept on the side with a chair. And we saw no a photo. One said that uh, he died in his sleep. You know the oh. same position position. It wasn't it? the same. What kind of? Oh, he died in Light's arms. <laughs> well, but, but he, he, he kind of fell on the side with the chair. So it's, it's like an, he died in his sleep. You can say it that way. Because, yeah, we saw this panel from the manga where uh, he's sleeping and Wantari's like, you, you slept in that position again. Why don't you use the bed? And he's like, uh, I, I don't have time to do this. <laughs> like, no, just no, no, raise me up, please. Take it in, man. And he's, back up. Yeah, he's just... He's basically sitting in his chair, but on the side, and he sleeps like this. So what that he just, whoop, and he keeps working. <laughs> oh. He was dedicated. Hey, I'm gonna love him till the end. Yeah, but now we're being introduced to Melo and Denier. Yeah, both kids who are at Watery's orphanage. So they are. We know they are intelligent. Like, of course they are intelligent. Yeah. The, the, but they're not they be intelligent enough like L to catch Kira. Pretty sure they will manage to do something. The th that's what I've been saying. Like, L, last episode I did say L left enough clues, and we got the, con the confirmation in this episode. He left enough clues for them to reach the same conclusion. All they have to do is 
you know, place. He gave them the last piece. Like, he gave them a full puzzle with one piece missing, but he gave them the piece and just said, place it there. <laughs> so all they have to do is do just, it. Just uh, do <laughs> it. But that's why I feel, that's how I feel this is going to go. Like, I don't know if they, they didn't get the information, but it's there for the taking. But it's interesting because both character are so much different from one another and so much different from Elle that that would be interesting to watch. I don't know. Like I said, I, I know nothing. I never even That's saw That's why I said clip. it would be interesting to watch. I never even saw a clip of them. So I don't know their personalities. <laughs> I know what they look like and that's it. But, uh, I mean, there is a reason why the guy, Roger, called them two to tell them, like, Elle is dead. So they were close to Elle in some kind of way. And I mean, Nier was doing well, a puzzle Mello with... Well, and Nier, of course, they were close to L, M and N, come on. L, M, N, yeah, sure. But, uh, so yeah, so, and Nier was making a puzzle with L's initial on it. So I'm pretty sure, like, they were very close and they looked up to him. Mm -hmm. So, Talk I'm expecting them to, I'm expecting them to, you know, find revenge for him, which is something that frustrated me again when we were with the police officers and they're like, oh, let's celebrate the fact that you're becoming the new L. This is not funny. Why would you enjoy this? He's dead. He's not, you know, he's not taking Reti time off. He's not retiring. He's not retiring, exactly. No. So you shouldn't even try to, to replace him or anything or even enjoy having to do this. So I that got me mad a little bit. And then you've got him like saying so happily, like, well, we're gonna, you know, uh, avenge him and I'm like this is not supposed to be funny either what the fuck Matsuda <laughs> well Matsuda has been always the dumb from the team well it's been it's been 10 days too so they probably moved on but uh, moved on in 10 days I mean with someone they've been working on with weeks and months and I mean he's in their eyes especially like the older ones like the chief he's a kid he's he's totally a kid like he's got two years he's two years older than than light yeah so how can he not see? Anyway, <laughs> all right. So let's mo let's move on ourselves to the next episode, yeah. guys. Because uh, I'm gonna get really mad if we keep going. Like <laughs> like I said, this is. Um, I'm sorry if it gets obnoxious, but uh, L being my favorite character, I'm gonna try to bring it back to him as much as much as I can. Like as much as I I, I will probably enjoy seeing these two new characters work in his place. They won't be L. They won't replace him in my heart. And it, like I said, it feels to me like he did all the work and all they have to do is... Like Bram and Game of Thrones. Everyone did all the work and they but just... But they're going to get the reward. Or we get the reward at the oh, end. I don't want this to happen. <laughs> like, I don't know what they're, how they're going to play this, but in my heart, if Light gets taken down, it's going to be because of what Al did. He deserves that, at least. You will see. All right, yeah. so let's end there and just... Yes, move on. on to the next episode, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode with us. If you want to see the next one right away, it is already up on Patreon. The link is in the description. So go click and subscribe. And if you don't want to, just wait for the next episode to be up on YouTube next Tuesday. Exactly. Yeah. See you then. Bye, guys. Bye.